Okay, so this is gonna be a fun little video that I saw like King of Lightning and other One Piece like YouTubers do. Uh, and it's called the Witch Devil Fruit Would You Have like basically quiz. And honestly, I wanna do this because I'm really curious as to what I will get. Cause listen, I personally would want, I don't know, Laws is pretty great. Uh, flamingos is pretty great. The meta meta no me, the fire fruit is really great. Hell, even Kizaru. I would love Kizaru because like being able to move at the speed of light, light in general, laser beams, like it, that's nasty. Even Eneru. But I don't know what I'll get. So uh, without further ado, let's jump into it. Okay, let's start with our name first. So I'm just gonna use. I'm just gonna put VG whatever. That that's me. Okay. Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna edit this, so, uh, yeah. Which is the closest to your dream home? What does... Th how does this determine anything when it comes to <laughs> double fruit? But okay, um... See, they should've... If, if I wanted Eneru's fruit, they should've put a house on a home... On a, on a moon. So, luxury condo, many friends and parties. Modest and peaceful cabin in the wilderness with very few close people or nobody. That's big Eneru energy right there. Fancy RV or houseboat cost. Well, no, actually, that's also big. Hmm. You know what? I wouldn't want a giant mansion. I would actually love a beachside home, bro. A beachside home with a pool next to it makes it kind of redundant, but. That's alright. That view is gorgeous, so I'm going with that. You and a good friend of yours are walking down the street. Your friend who's in a really bad mood bumps to somebody's shoulder and immediately gets angry at the person. This begins escalating into a fist fight. Okay, okay. and it doesn't look like your friend has a chance at winning. <laughs> first off, first off if this was realistic and my friend had no chance of winning this fist fight, bro, you gotta, you gotta, even if you're mad, you gotta assess the situation. If the dude got a bigger body build, he's just bigger than you, you no matter how angry you are, don't, don't square up with someone you know you're gonna lose with, bro. Because if you get taken out, chances are I'm gonna get taken out. Take out your phone and record the fight. It's getting pretty entertaining. Hmm. Immediately help my friend beat this guy. I don't care if I might be if it might be his fault. I don't want to see my friends get hurt. I keep walking and ignore them. Both my friends being irrational, so I'll let him solve it himself. Try to break up the fight right away. Violence won't solve anything in this case. You know what? I, I look. I'm not a pushover either, but I like to avoid violence whenever necessary because in my humble opinion, it's no good just fighting people just cause you know, whatever. So it is what it is there. What sounds like a dream profession to you or your current line of work? Okay. Something to do with puzzles, thinking, like professor, scientist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. hmm. uh, I don't mind puzzles, but everything else. Mm -hmm. Something to do with entertainment, you know? Yeah, I wouldn't, I mean, a performer, I mean, am I performing for you guys now? Hey, how you doing? Something to do with money, finance, or power. Marketer, stock trader, CEO, something with hands-on labor. Uh, just anything that seems like it'll work. Something that will let me travel a lot. Something to do with serving a large number of people. Something to do with designing or crafting. I mean, art, I mean, I'm an art guy. I like, my, my ultimate final, like form is something that I really want to do is if you guys know like I made it like one or two short films at the beginning of the channel I really want to be a cinematographer like eventually so you know it is what it is there which the color do you like the most if y'all know me green is the goat color green is my favorite color of all time which of these would you be more likely to share on social media uh, inspirational quotes that <laughs> I really use now for, uh, that ain't me Food? Nope. A selfie or mirror shots at the gym because I'm looking good. I mean, I never look good. Funny videos, pictures I found online, favorite art, music, or even stuff I made myself. Uh, it's between these two. Uh, I'll probably put. I'll probably put funny videos. You know what? Yeah, I'll put funny videos. Which club would you be most interested? In? Cooking, go home club, math, science, history, music, drama, or fine art, student council, sports, MMA. Sports MMA sounds like fun, but. Man, realistically speaking, I wouldn't mind the go home club because at the end of the day, you wake up at like 6 a.m. and go to school back in the day. And then, you, you know, why would you want to be out from like 6 in the morning to like 5 or 6 o'clock in the afternoon and then just to do it all every day? I don't know, man. I don't know about that. 
But if we're doing it like modern day and just like taking a couple hours out of your day, you know what? I would do sports MMA. I, I would do that. Cause like I, I want music, drama, fine art, but that's already part of my school. So like, I'm not even gonna like, you know, do that. So my little sports MMA. Your close friends inform me that they no longer want you in their group. You're given no explanation as to why, what will you do? Uh, I'll just remain alone that I never really trusted them any. Okay. That, th if you if you say that, that's that's a Sasuke quote, <laughs> like straight up. Uh, what a bunch of scum. This is another anime quote. I did nothing wrong, this is how I'm treated. I'll show them a thing. These are all Sasuke quotes. I need to find out what truly happened and fix it. There must be some kind of misunderstanding. Uh, I'll just find some new friends to hang out with, though it pains me we were just too different to stay together. You know what? It's either the last. Mm, I'll say the last one. I'll say the last one because if, if they just kick you out, sure. You know what? Yeah, I'm going with that one because I, I, for me personally, if something happens like that and I get no explanation, I, I have to find out why. I have to find out what happened. Like if it, just straight up tell me if you don't like me, fine. I don't give a shit. But if, if I can't have that lingering question in the like the back of my head, you're in class for a final exam review today. What will you do? Um. Honestly, this is this is me. This was me all entire to high school. Granted, I was salutatorian, so flex a little bit. But to me, I always analyze school stuff. So whenever I got school like assignments and like lessons, especially when they're, I would pay attention when they would say like, "Oh, this is gonna be on the final," blah blah blah. I kind of knew. I always made estimated guesses on like what, like what seemed like test material whenever we got it. So I would always assume. So whenever we did get the reviews, I would see them like, oh yeah, so this is exactly what I was thinking. And I, I would pay attention a little bit, but I, I, I would just genuinely assume because I'm not a big studying guy. Like I would do, I'm, I'm much rather like do the assignments and memorize it. So that way I can just, you know, but so this is how I would do it. But yeah, which fantasy world do you enjoy the most? Dark medieval, you know, not after berserk, dude. F that, F this. Not only Berserk, but that that era is not a good time to live in unless you have a lot of money. If you don't have money, you are screwed. Fantasy Vibrant or fi Vibrant Fantasy Dreamland. Mm. That looks nice. Looks hard in the eyes though. You know what? Let's do Huge Adventure, bro. F that Huge Adventure. I like the other one, but like Peaceful and Beautiful Man it sounds boring. Man. Even though I'm I'm always sitting at home or going to work and recording videos, so it is what it is. When you are at home, what do you typically enjoy doing most? I beat the f out of my dick so goddamn hard that I can't even feel my left leg. My left leg has went totally numb. How many friends would you say you have? Few close friends that I love and trust. None really, f me. bro. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this guy, like, okay, that just looks funny. It's like none really. It's like very big. Like, I don't have any friends. And like, this post just add some rain here and it's golden. None really, mainly family or, or a best friend of a mix with many people. I have a lot of friends, and mostly everyone knows me in some way. I'm pretty popular. Uh, I have a good circle of good friends, and I have, have met many people. I'm somewhat known. Uh, I would say this would be me in high school because I do, I would have my select friends, and then you know, like, I mean, everyone pretty much can probably agree with this. You probably have your select friends, and then you have like a lot of people. If you, if you were an easy person to like, not, not in that way, but if you were an easy person to get along with, I feel like you can probably just pretty much get along with anybody. And if that was the case, then this would be everyone right now. But we're talking about current, so I would say this one. I have like four or five friends and that's pretty much it that I'd like I trust like really, really well. Uh, and I have a lot of acquaintances, but I would say I really have like just four or five close, close friends. You are some form of social gathering and you find a person nearby speaking to a group of friends, family about a topic you are passionate about. This person is blatantly speaking nonsense and everyone seems to believe them, even though you think it to be false. What do you do? <sighs> you are someone, you find a person. Okay. Speaking to a friend, a group of friends telling me about a topic in the, there was use. Okay. So here's the thing. I, I don't care about what people think about what I like, but it's like, it is like, I think everyone can agree, even though you think like that, if, if someone's speaking a whole bunch of nonsense, like it is here, it's still going to irritate you, especially when it's just spreading, spreading false, like information. It's like annoying. 
who cares all the time and isn't worth the correct time. Um, I would just wait until that person leaves and tell everyone to tell some so that I don't get into them. Second, that maybe I'm the one who's misinformed. No, 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 no. If you if you believe what you're like, it's okay to admit when you're wrong. But if you are 100% correct and the person you know is spouting BS, do not like second guess yourself. Who is this person think they are? People get deceived and bind to the BS. Mm. I will say I would just wait because I don't want to get into an argument and get into a fight over like a piece of fiction or something. So I would just wait and be like, yeah, he was not really telling the truth because uh, mm. so yeah. You walk into a grocery store and a couple of guys are hanging out right beside- I feel like I'm gonna get an ass double fruit, bro. Oh no, I'm like, I'm picking decent choices, but then like, I'm avoiding a lot of confrontation. I feel like if this was like, if I were to get like a gum gum fruit or like whatever, or like an awesome like aggressive fruit, I feel like I would have to be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna attack everybody, but I feel like I'm gonna get some ass type fruit. You walk into a grocery store and a couple of guys are hanging out right beside the entrance. The group of friends see you and start clearly mocking and calling names. And they don't look weak. What do you do? What do you mean they don't look weak? Like they got like you got a scout around you, bro? Like come on now. Obviously, like whatever I know, they completely show no interest. Um I live in New Jersey, so I dealt with this a lot actually. Uh it, it, it is what it is. High school, whatever. Again. Uh I basically got along with everyone. I either got roasted and was just like, oh well, here comes the burns, but I never really got bullied or whatever, but there have been some times where like I go like into especially like a bodega or something and then like you, you step out and then like there's always like a group of people, not the best, and then you're just like, you know, they might make some comments, especially if I, like if you picked up some like sandwich or something. So I'm definitely gonna ignore it because like, I always ignore them because like, look man, where I live at, you might say something wrong and it's all up plot the strap, I'm just saying. So I might, I'm just gonna ignore. You are handed a thousand by a complete stranger. However, they tell you that you must donate all this money to a charity. What will you do? Am I the charity? Cause bro, I need, I need the money. What the fuck? <laughs> bro, I will donate to charity if I am well off and I can. I do not, I am not well off and I can't at the moment. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to save for a car right now. Jeez. What kind of grades do did you often receive in school? Uh, I would say A's and B's, yeah. C's, I would say, like, later half of college. I didn't even finish college yet, so, I mean, it is what it is there. Uh, which of these animals is your favorite? Oh, doggy. Yeah, dog, cat, owl, fox, elephant, scorpions, fuck that. Hippos are scary. Uh, oh, no, snakes. I mean, I love Snake Man. I love King Cobra and all that. No, absolutely not. Wolf. Uh, is that a, what the hell was that? Anything, anything, oh, anything ancient or dinosaur? Uh, lion, dolphin. I'm probably gonna pick which one I think is the is your oh just favorite, not the coolest. I mean, if there was a shark here, I'd probably pick shark. I like dolphins, but shark has always been one of my favorite like sea creatures. But come on, man. Doggos are like I know we we could pick wolf, but like, which of these animals is your favorite? Ah, eh, fuck it. Yeah, you know what? Let, let's go wolf. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Wait. A standard zo wait. 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 This this fruit is godlike. Wait a minute. Wait. Wait. We gotta assess the situation first. We gotta think about it first. Before before we get mad, before before we call any bullshit, we gotta think about it first. This is actually the strongest devil fruit known to man. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? And I know you're thinking, it's not a logia, it's not anything. And I, and like and I know what you're saying. Hey geek. What nonsense are you spitting that you're saying that this is the strongest that we've ever created? Keep in mind, Pell, the owner of the falcon fruit, he, my man flew into the sky with a nuclear and took it point blank to the face. And he survived with like minimal injuries. So what that's telling me is that this devil fruit 
is by far one of the strongest devil fruits ever known to man. So, I am happy with the results. Look, I may have wanted the fire fire fruit, I may have wanted the quake quake fruit, I may have wanted the... Hey man, if you want to take the quiz, then it'll be down on the link. The link, the link will be down in the description below. You guys can take the quiz. Let me know that, what you guys got as your uh, your devil fruit, because uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be hard to top mine. I'm just gonna say that right.